Good morning, gorgeous. Happy Friday. My name is Gail Burwell. I'm the founder of the Rockstar Mindset Show and the founder of the Rockstar Mindset. And today I'm coming with a big topic is how to put yourself out there to escape your nine to five and turn your passion into a business. And I heard so many women around me, they don't dare to put themselves out there. They're not comfortable with their one image. And I just want to tell you how to overcome that. Okay. So firstly, you have to know something. Most of the time, when you're going to put yourself out there in order to turn your passion into your business, the one priority is your audience and your people, because you have to put yourself in their shoes. You know, they are bombarded by information every day, what I call information bonanza, every day, constantly. How can you expect for them to be visible and contact you if you're not visible for them? You know what I mean? So it's really a question to be there for them, to provide to them the best value possible that you can, and to be consistent. Because if you think about it most of the time, when you notice someone on internet, it's because this person show up in your feed consistently, every day, weekly, monthly, and always bringing so much high value that you couldn't, you couldn't just not paying attention to this person. It is exactly the same when you want to turn your passion into a business. Your priority is your audience, is your people, the people you want to serve. And it's really a question of shifting your mindset around it because it's not about you. Creating a business is not about you. It's about helping people. And I truly believe that if this is what you want, this is the first things um, coming, to your, coming to your mind to create your business. Also, of course, you want more freedom, impact, and flexibility. Completely agree with that. But your audience is your key priority, and you have to put yourself in their shoes. The second strategy I wanted to share with you is really about what is truly visibility. And most of the time, a lot of women have this fear of visibility. For me, visibility is a question of creativity. There, are, there is so much out there that you can create every day in order for your audience to see you. As long as you're using a media channel or a communication channel that you love, either it's speaking, writing, interviewing people, use and choose the communication channel that you love. Because once you will do that, you will share your passion, your love for what you do even more, and your audience will resonate with that. So for example, me, I really wanted to help a woman to boost their mindset and well-being during these challenging times. What I did, I created the Rockstar Wellness Series, which is available in my Facebook group. And every week, I invite an expert in order to share their experience and expertise in a specific topic. Is a question of creativity. Being visible is a question of creativity to the end of the day. The question is, what do you love to do? What do you love to create? Because there is so much out there. You can either create a podcast, an online summit, videos, blog posts, or even, even write a book or ebook. You have so much choices out there. The question is, what do you love to do? which communication channel you want to use to speak to your audience. So I really wanted to share these two, sorry, these two strategies with you because they matter to me, they make all the difference. And if you want to go for a deeper dive and do it quickly, then you will do it on your own. I invite you to book an escape call with me where we will discuss and see how we can turn things around. In the meantime, I wish you a fantastic, fantastic day. Happy Friday. And I will see you tomorrow. I'm sending you so much love.